that as well. Did you glean anything, Judge, from these oral arguments today? Well, I don't know if this case may be a bad case upon which to see the broadest pressure campaign being brought by the federal government against social media companies, private individuals, as well as, um, you know, uh, viewpoints uh, disfavored by the government in American history. This is going to be huge. Normally, when you talk about the First Amendment, it's normally about, you know, the 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 First Amendment amendment where the it, it constrains government from from interfering with your freedom of speech what they've got here is they've got they want government to be able to suppress your free speech on the grounds that they think their free speech is more important the whole thing is upside down and the White House is arguing that the court cannot stop them because government must be allowed to, freak spe to speak freely. And I have no problem with the government being allowed to speak freely. But by the same token, Americans have to be allowed to speak freely. And they are ordering, they are demanding that social media companies shut down individuals and their free speech. And the amazing part of all this is that the unrelenting pressure that the White House and the federal government can bring can can be enormous. But when you think about 2020 and you think about why would the White House be so interesting in suppressing people's opinions when the Supreme Court allows hate speech, you can say something that is hateful, that is protected by the Supreme Court, but you can't give your opinion on COVID. And all of a sudden they're going to say, we agree with the White House. The, the, the thing that taints it is the billions of dollars that were made by pharmaceutical companies that were then able to force the government to say, stop people from saying, don't take the vaccine. And right now today, if you want to give blood, you know what they ask you? Have you taken the COVID vaccine before you're allowed to give blood?